So much has been said about the influence of social media on the young people around the world, with the rise in internet connectivity around the world, especially in Zimbabwe. Use of social media among youth has become a rising phenomenon. Use of social media is its positive and negatives. To help me shed light on this, I interviewed Stuart Mavin, a media expert. This is what he has to say. Social media has seen it uh, coming uh, up so much in Zimbabwe. Uh, we're looking at uh, Facebook, Google Plus, uh, LinkedIn, WhatsApp, Twitter. But uh, to my own uh, research and uh, understanding, I think Facebook is the top uh, social media site that is uh, in Zimbabwe. Okay. Uh, the high rise of uh, participation on social networks. I uh, think uh, it has been due to the images of cheap gadgets or say mobile gadgets that uh, the youth can use, especially the phones now they are very affordable that almost anyone can afford to buy a phone that, is, that can be connected onto the internet. Also uh, the cheap internet, the broadband that our network providers are providing for the people. Uh, we can also look at the platforms themselves. There are so many platforms that have come up and they are cheaper to communicate with using and like using the ordinary or the the way we used to like texting or phoning. So people have tended to move from the way we used to communicate into the social network uh, platforms. Okay. Uh, besides the good the good stuff, like uh, sharing videos, sharing pictures or even helping each other on school week uh, online. There are other things also that come in when we talk of social media. That includes uh, uh, the youth usually tend to spend more time on the internet. Thereby, they lose their uh, sleeping time and this can also affect their grades in, in school. And also there's a thing that is called sexting where they send uh, nude pictures or semi-nude pictures that can circulate uh, on the social networks. And also there's uh, what you call cyberbullying where people are uh, bullied on the online where date messages or humiliating messages are put up on people's uh, whole, pa whole pages or they are sent into their inboxes to the youth in zimbabwe who are using social media i would advise them that they should be they should select the people that they really know or their close friends to communicate with because you never know if you take anyone from the outside world that you don't even know you don't know what they will do with your information that you put up on on those social sites also uh with the social sites are uh, growing uh in the future employers will also just go onto your profile on any social site and see what kind of person you are look at your character so be aware of uh things that you post on your or papers or that you communicate it through the social sites.